what's good youtube so today i'm finna do like a slow down hair tutorial and we finna do a little getting ready with me and i think i actually i might record me doing my makeup or something so literally i had straightened up my hair like i had straightened like the front a little bit i really don't want to put too much heat like in the front i don't want to burn it out okay i just started growing my edges like my edges is a little thin on this side you feel me like I had to slow down on the sewing, you feel me? They like growing back, you know? So if you see on my videos that it's a little bald head on this side, I already know. You don't got to tell me. I already know it's in rotation. Edges is in route, bitch. 2020, edges in, in motherfucking route. You can see I'm just going to start doing my hair and I want y'all to pay attention because 2020, we need to start doing stuff ourselves instead of paying people because that's how I save a lot of money. I just rather do it myself. If I gotta walk around with my hair messed up, you feel me? That's all. Think about all the money that you spend on getting your hair now. I want you to get a book and I want you to add it up every time you went to go and get your hair done. That's money that you could have saved, boo. And just did it yourself. I mean, it ain't gonna look all that when you first, you know, when you first start doing it. But you, but you gotta be patient. You feel me? Like it's going to come. You know, them skills gonna come. You gonna learn how to do that. Whoop whoop whoop. Right. And everything is going to work out. So, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to take my hair. And I'm going to put it in a little ponytail, right? And I'm sorry if my wedding ring is blind, y'all. But it's just... I, I, I don't <laughs> okay, so I'm going to actually take some beeswax. I hate using... I hate using edge control because my hair is too soft. And honestly, I don't care if y'all don't see how soft my hair is. But it curl up. Little whoops. So I just go ahead and just she said keep the open period. <clears throat> okay. And I'm just gonna go ahead. And I'm just gonna, you know, I'm just gonna get my little edges and I'ma just, just try to lay them. y'all see that right there y'all see the edges it look a little bald here right there see when you see it's a little bald head go ahead and you know part do a little party part and you feel me go ahead and swoop it to the ponytail go ahead and swoop it to the ponytail okay okay so Y'all, this looks terrible. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. So, I'm gonna just, you know, go ahead and take me some more edges. I mean, I'll be trying not to get too much, you know. But at the end of the day, this is what it is when you don't pay. So, y'all just gonna have to understand if you if you take in that step to. If you taking that step to do it by yourself, that's that's what it is, baby girl. You're gonna have to deal with whatever you come up with. You're gonna have to just roll with it. I really don't know what direction I'm trying to go. Make it come out like that. You feel me? You gotta, you gotta swoop it. You gotta make that little edge come out. Make it come out. <laughs> Listen, when I be doing my hair, bro, I don't. I don't know i just be having to keep you got to keep going over it you know what like it look a little bit i really like baby hair so okay 
grief of several people. That's how it's gonna be when you're doing it. I'm gonna keep coming out. Hmm? It look okay. Shoot, I don't care. So once I see that I got a little consistent little, I got these LED lights, so y'all, it's gone. Oh. No, listen, I'm not a professional. Now, see this, this. Okay, so since I already done my edges, like right here, you just gonna see me fix it up. Like, you know, any spot that I didn't see, like, you know, that had a consistent bend or, you know, I just want my swoops to have like a dramatic effect. Not really dramatic, but you know, like when hairstylists do your hair, you know, you still want it to look nice. Even after you already got your pattern or however you gonna do it, after you put it in a ponytail, you just gonna go ahead and straighten it up. And I did use some got to be glue hold spray on there just to like, you know, hold everything in place. Cause when you just starting to do your hair, like you would, <laughs> that's my baby in the background. You would literally use like a scarf, you know, to hold it. But what I learned is that the got to be glue is definitely like a good holding uh, method. So you don't have to use the scarf and mess up. Right here you just gonna see me you know finally put it in a ponytail and I got everything and that's my little baby in the background y'all okay so I finally got it in a ponytail and you see those little like the little stringy things I'm just gonna you know fix it up I mean honestly I ain't the shop and okay y'all want to learn how to do something okay so I'm just gonna show y'all how to do it you want to save a little bit of money and you know this year um yeah, so you're just going to see me fixing up the swoops and put my ponytail on. And the style that I was going to do was actually a rope ponytail. But I wasn't able to do that one because I got the wrong hair. So, I was able to do something else. But it was still cute though. Still something natural, everyday go. You know what I'm saying? The everyday little look got going on. Something quick. But yeah. So... Yeah, I think I did pretty good. I don't know. Comment down below how how good you think I did. And, you know, I really did this video so I can show other women, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, even if you didn't have no money to pay to get your hair done. I mean, I could have paid to get my hair done. But, you know, even if, like, you know, even if you didn't want to, you know, you could always do it yourself. That's always an option.
right here, I literally had forgot to record me um, putting the ponytail on properly. I'm gonna show you guys how to do that in the next video. Um, so this is actually expression braiding hair. I actually uh, just braided it up and I'm just gonna wrap it into a bun. Um, I mean, I'm pretty sure you could use any hair. It really don't matter. But I really don't like the dollar braiding hair because it has like that shiny look. And I really don't like that look. So I just had braided up, you know, some hair. And I'm just going to, you're going to see me wrap it into a bun. Right here you're gonna see me putting a rubber band on it i mean actually i would i would recommend you guys to use a bobby pin a black bobby pin just to like secure the uh braid yeah so i actually had to use a rubber band and when i do my hair honestly i don't leave it in for a long time it'd be like something just for that night you know so that's why i'm going to start uploading these videos because these are little quick tutorials that you could do like for that night you know what i'm saying and take it down the next day and just wear it like you know just if you wanted to switch it up so yeah oh ooh. Ooh, baby girl oh i learned two things in spanish beautiful low show <laughs> literally the after I was in the back talking I mean um you know what I'm saying to a hairstylist you know this isn't the best but honestly when it's free honestly truly <laughs> it's the shit <laughs> but yes I slay my hair in period put you on some little makeup and some little lashes and some little eyebrows and some little whatever it is that you want to put on with a cute outfit you're gonna be popping boo period if you like this video make sure you hit the thumbs up and the subscribe button and stay tuned